tell us about the new season? That's what I've been trying to figure out. I've been trying really hard not to say anything about the new season because I think everyone should just tune in and watch um, because I get yelled at when I say anything about the new season. But I think it's all right to say, you know, at the end of last season, we split everyone up, um, sent them to different parts of the world, even changed their jobs. Um, and um, so we start this season taking a look at how things are going for them, um, split up, and then um, why would they come together again? So that's what the season opener is about, is getting the team back together again. And really, it's you know, really it's about how do you get a family back together again when mom and dad are split up. So that's sort of a, that's, that's the season opener. How's that? Were you ever worried or hesitant about splitting yes. them up? Oh, about in the re <laughs> yes, in general. <laughs> yes, in general. Uh, about splitting them up and like the repercussions that it could cause with like the story and the fans? Well, we certainly considered um, the, uh, the results of splitting them up. I think, you know, that old thing that you have to give um, the audience what they want in a way they don't expect it. Um, is we, we work hard on that, and sometimes we're successful, and some, you know, somebody always sees what we're, gonna, what we're up to. It's awful. That's the trouble with the internet. Um, but yes, uh, we, uh, we agonized over it, and um, you know, it's not just us. Um, I talk to our stars a lot about it. Um, there's a network, there's a studio, there's marketing people. Then there's what we know uh, and hear uh, amongst the writing staff and, um, you know, everybody, what we, what we think we should do. And that's what we decided to do in the end. But worried and hesitant, yeah. Hesitant, no. Worried, yes. You know, once you commit, you gotta, you gotta go for it. Are we going to see David's character in Afghanistan? Or yes, whatever? yes. We're going to see um, uh, Brennan in Maluku, in the Maluku Islands of Indonesia, doing what she and Daisy are doing there. And we'll see what uh, uh, Ruth is doing in Afghanistan before they come back and why they come back. Uh, what would bring everyone back together again is sort of the central. And where did you shoot those? How did you do that in LA? Oh, it's really hard. Um, um, you know, um, there's a pretty good, um, is this like showing too much behind the scenes people? I'd love it if people thought we were in Paris and um, uh, Maluku and uh, Afghanistan. Um, we uh, shot the Arboretum for Maluku and lots of green screen and CGI. And then uh, Santa Clarita is actually pretty good Afghanistan and there's a village out there that looks like an Afghan. Uh, Afghan village, uh, so that we could do that if you point the cameras in the right way. And again, green screen and CGI. Um, and Paris is much easier because uh, like we just did an apartment for the view of the Eiffel Tower. If Love you can it. tell it's CGI, then that's a shame. Um, if you can't, then we were actually in. We read that it may be an female interest. I know, but how did that get up? Entertainment Weekly. I know. I've never. I've never. Um, I never said that. No. And I, I keep refusing to say it, that. Um, I, it's. I, that's what I'm refusing to say. You might get David or Emily to tell you yes or no, but um, um, we do have. We have cast uh, an actress to play a part for some uh, episodes in the show. <laughs> Who is the actress? Can you say who an actress is? Should I say? Are you saying on stage? <laughs> Oh, it's already Is it? Did it? Was it? Was it Meryl Streep? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> was it? Was it Catherine Winnick? Yeah. It might have been Beyonce. Oddly enough. Who? Oh yeah. Go on. We have time for two more questions. But they don't want to, actually. <laughs> Beyonce's going to be on the show. Beyonce's going to be on the show. Well, I care about it. I'm just going to justify that line. We're just going to say that. Much more than From now on. <laughs> how, how much life do you have is in the phone still there? What? Do you, is there an end point that you see? Is there a storyline well, you It depends on what day of the week you catch me. Sometimes I wish they'd just call up and cancel it. Um, no. <laughs> well, no, really. But I don't mean it. Um, I, I'm, I know that we can do a, a very good job for another couple of years. I, I would think eight seasons would be good. If it goes longer, then um, I have to adjust some plans. Um, but, I, you know, it's a good engine. They're a very good story engine. Um, it, it's got, you know, I, I, I don't think it's like Law & Order where you can swap out actors. Uh, I, our show is, I, 
more a fan kind of thing. We had people like our our characters, and I'm not sure how much screen around we could do with the cast um, and, and hang on to everybody. And I and I'm pretty sure we couldn't. Um, it would be a, a huge, huge chore to replace one of those two leads and hope it went on. Um, you know, the uh, X Files had a hard time with that one. Jillian were gone. So, but I, you know, I, I could see us doing a very good solid eight, um, eight years. But that doesn't count what happens to our ratings. But uh, I mean, no one knows. No, no one knows. Uh, before the season. Oh. Oh, do you think we'll ever have a season with uh, Bones and together? Do you ever see that uh, happening with fans? I don't not see it happening. All right. How's that? <laughs> All right. So it's a possibility. I, here's what I'll say. I have no interest in them getting together on the last day of the series. I don't think that's a good way to use the characters. How's that? That's good enough. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.